Um, just wanted to hop on to give you guys a nice little yoga break. It's good for the morning as your warm up, or if you need to take a break from your computer or from your Netflix or for taking care of kids, just some stretches and a little bit of flow to uh, get the muscles warmed up and the breath going. So let's go ahead and get started in our cross-legged seat. Just making sure to root down through the pelvic bones, sitting up nice and long through the spine, relaxing the shoulders, keeping the neck long. If your eyes are open, go ahead and close them. Take a deep breath in through the nose and let it go. One more time, deep breath in through the nose and out through the nose. With your next ex inhale, go ahead and draw your shoulders up to your ears, nice and tight. Take a breath in, and then with your breath out, let it go. Roll them down your spine. Drawing circles as you go, again, inhale, roll up, and exhale, roll down and back. One more time, inhale, roll up, exhale, roll down and back. Good, this time, with your next breath in, sweeping your arms up to the sky, interlacing your fingers, spin your palms to the ceiling, and then as you exhale, reach over to the right or to the left, doesn't matter, we'll hit both sides. Keep the opposite pelvic bone pressing into the ground. Inhale, come up through center. Exhale, reach over to the left. Inhale, come up through center. This time with your exhale, bring your arms parallel to the mat. Go ahead and sink into your belly, rounding out through your back. Drop your chin into your chest. Then take a breath in, sit up nice and tall, open your heart. One more time, exhale, sink, roll in. This time with your inhale, sit up nice and tall, lift the chest. And with your exhale, release your hands and come over onto your hands and knees. We'll just get a little spinal fluid moving into your tabletop, shoulders over wrist, hips over knees. Belly button draws in. With your inhale, release the belly to the mat, flip the tailbone up, look up. Exhale, squeeze the belly button in, roll closed, arch your back. Nice, slow, fluid movements. Inhale, roll open. Exhale, roll closed. One more time. Inhale, roll open. Exhale, roll closed. Nice. From here, go ahead and tuck your tail, your toes under. Lift your tailbone into the sky. Find your downward facing dog. Just a reminder, first round, we always take it slow and check our alignment from foundation all the way up. So feet just barely hip width distance apart. Nice deep bend in your knees, tailbone's the highest point on your body. Belly button pulls in, chest presses to your thighs. Lift away from the mat, lifting out of your shoulders. Sink your weight into your legs and your heels, take the pressure out of your wrists. And then from here you can start to shake your head yes and no. You can open your mouth really wide to stretch out your cheeks. And maybe start to pedal your feet out a little bit, alternately bending one knee and then the other. Remember your down dog is a great pose for some fresh energy if you're feeling tired throughout the day. Full body stretch here. And with your next breath in, rise high to your toes, bend your knees, and as you breathe out, walk, step, jump towards your hands with your toes together, soften your knees. Take a breath in, lift up halfway, flatten your back, lengthen your spine. And with your breath out, fold forward over your hips, Let's find that again. Inhale, lift up halfway, work the shoulder blades together. Exhale, release forward. Last time, inhale, lift up halfway, lengthen, press away from your legs. Exhale, fold. Good, we'll take a few rounds of sun A, so draw your belly button in. With your inhale, spread your toes, reach out, rise up nice and tall, palms together. And then with your exhale, hinging forward, bringing your hands through heart center. Breath in, lift up halfway. Breath out, plant your hands, step back. We'll find our first plank, so we'll pause here. Again, great full body exercise. Full core work, upper body. Hits all the spots. So remember, if you can do no other core work during the day, if you find a plank, you're gonna hit all those necessary spots in the abdomen. So drawing the belly button in, you're straight as a board, your shoulders are over your wrist, shoulders, hips, knees in a line. Take a breath in. With your breath out, press away from the ground. Remember your modification is to drop your knees and lift your toes your diagonal from the ground, from your knees up to the top of your head. Wherever you're at, take one more breath in and one more breath out. Now for this round, let's all release down to our knees, lift our toes, take a breath in. With your breath out, lower everything to the mat. Inhale, lift up through your baby cobra, keeping the glutes engaged. 
Exhale, over your knees, over your toes, back to your downward facing dog. Your next breath in, rise up again, bend your knees. Exhale to the front. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold forward. Let's go through that again. Breath in, reach out, rise up, strong foundation on the mat. Breath out, hinge forward, lead down with your heart. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, plant your hands, step back. Remember, you have that option to lower down to your knees. Full high to low push up, nice and slow. Whole body lowers down at once till your arms bend to, the to 90 degrees. Then with your inhale, press up. If you're an upward facing dog, your thighs stay lifted off the mat. And then with your exhale, shift back to your down dog. Inhale, rise high to your toes. Bend your knees. Exhale to the front. Breathe in, lift up halfway. Breathe out, fold forward. Let's take that another round. Inhale, reach out, rise up, gather some energy. Exhale, start to re release and let go of some of that stress. Inhale, lift up halfway. Exhale, plant your hands, step back, come down through the modification, full push up, up to you. Either way, elbows squeeze into the rib cage. Inhale, lift through your cobra or up dog. And exhale, down to your downward facing dog. Pause here. Pedal your feet out again, we'll find just a little bit more opening. So this time, pressing your left foot into the mat. With your inhale, reach that right heel all the way up nice and high. Open up through your hips. And with your exhale, step the right foot in between both hands. Find your low lunge. Lengthening through the spine, start to lift your heart. Take a breath in. And with your breath out, peel your right hand up to the sky, opening through the chest. Then release the right hand down to the mat. Take a breath in, step the right foot back into your high plank. With your breath out, step the left foot forward, sink through the hips. Now you can release that left or that right knee if you'd like to. Inhale, peel the left arm up. Exhale, find your twist here. Then release the left hand down to the mat. Step the left foot back, come back to your down dog, or if you'd like a little bit more, come through your vinyasa. And back to your down dog. Inhale, rise high to your toes, bend your knees, exhale to the front. Inhale, lift up halfway, exhale, fold forward. One more time, breath in, reach out, rise up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, make your way through your vinyasa, whatever that means, wherever you are. Inhale through your up dog or cobra. Exhale to down dog. We'll find that same sequence again, starting on the left side. Inhale, left leg all the way up, all the way open. Exhale, stack the left hip on top of the right. Take another breath in. And with your breath out, step the left foot through and find your low lunge. Make sure that left knee stays stacked over the ankle. Take a breath in, lengthen through the spine. With your breath out, peel the left arm up to the sky. Open the chest. Release the left hand down. Breathe in. As you breathe in, squeeze that low belly in. Use your core to move. Breathe out. Left foot steps back to high plank. Inhale, step the right foot forward. Sink the hips. Exhale, peel the right arm up to the sky. Hold it here for one round of breath. Then release your right hand down. Breath in. Squeeze in that low belly. Breath out. Right foot steps back. Inhale here. Exhale to down dog or through your vinyasa. Come back to your downward facing dog. One more time, you can pedal your feet, wag your tail, maybe take a lion's breath, opening your mouth really wide, stretching out your cheeks, maybe shaking your head yes and no one more time. And then after your next exhale, come back down to your knees and returning to that cross-legged seat where we started. With your hands back on your knees, your palms up for some energy, palms down for some grounding. Go ahead and close your eyes one more time. Take a deep breath in. And with your breath out, start to let go, letting go of any other stress or tension. Inhale again. Exhale, release. Allowing your body to absorb some of that practice so you can continue on throughout your day. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Okay, I hope this brief practice gave you an opportunity to get up and move around and look for more of our short videos here while we continue to self-quarantine. We'll be one homegrown community 
together. Bring your hands to heart center, floating your thumbs through your third eye. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other. Namaste.